Officials say the three people infected were between the ages of 60 to 80 years old. The commissioner with the Connecticut Department of Public Health says this can happen, especially in the summer, since bacteria is likely to overpopulate in the water. The potential threat is real. Since July 1st, three cases of Vibrio vulnificus infections have been reported to the Connecticut Department of Public Health. Two people with open wounds were infected after swimming at local beaches, and the third person ate raw oysters from out of state. Commissioner Manisha Dutani calling this concerning. It's bacteria like this tend to overgrow, and if you have an open wound, you should never be gutting into water because there are any number of bacteria that are in the water. Even though the oysters were eaten out of state, the warning still stands. People tra travel to other states. They may go to other areas of the country. The Vibrio bacteria in oysters can cause bloodstream infections and wound infections from the waters can lead to a person's limb to be amputated. At Charlie's Fresh Catch in Vernon, the owner, Charles Ballard, has been reassuring his customers his shellfish are safe to eat and have been federally inspected. There is a, uh, a great linkage in place in regards to how the government's going to alert us if there's a problem. Our suppliers will also alert us and our customers will alert us as well. Being in the seafood industry for decades, Ballard says he will know if he received a bad batch. If a shellfish is bad, you can tell by the texture of the shell. A lot of times the shellfish will open because it doesn't have the muscle to close. Okay, and also it'll smell off. His customers being smart about where they shop. I eat most of my shellfish cooked. If the places you eat them from are trustworthy places, uh, you just a little cautious but not overly concerned. A Vibrio infection is extremely rare, so your best bet is if you have any open wounds to stay out of the water and to avoid eating any raw oysters from out of state. Reporting in Vernon, Carmen Chow, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.